sound like a newborn. We could be dancing and romancing in the kitchen on the West Wing in this mansion. What happened? <laughs> different as you can see jum roll please ba -ba -da -ba -da. look at the background i was looking for a space in my home where i could record with a cool background with not just you know you seeing the wall and i thought what other better place than my closet so i thought that i would face the camera where you could see my clothes in the background well some of them i just kind of rearranged my closet a little bit i wanted more of my pants to be down here and dress clothes to be down here. The pants don't have to be in any type of order because um, I like color throughout my closet. But um, yeah, so as you guys can see, I really love linen. And as you can see over there, I really love color. So um, yeah, so some of my videos might just start off in my closet so me and Giorgio just got back from the mall getting my um birthday presents my birthday is next Friday so in six days so my whole goal was to find some perfume um I know that some of my old dolls or the, I shouldn't say old dolls or the dolls that's been with me since the beginning I already know that I suffer from headaches migraines um sinus problems so I cannot just pick up any type of fragrance nor do I want to I don't like must smells unisex smells um I don't like loud floral smells or woody smells or earthy earthy tone smells I don't like those type of smells I'm more of a candy sweet fruity smell type of gal but I could not find what I was looking for and we went from department store to department store to Sephora I just gave up I just realized that maybe perfume is just not my thing and I'm gonna stick to my um body splashes that I normally get from Bath and Body Works so so you know mister was like okay so you didn't find what you were looking for so do you want some shoes? And I was like, yeah, I do. So, <laughs> Dillard's was having this awesome, awesome, awesome sale on shoes. So, let me show you guys what I got. Um, didn't even think to look in Dillard's. And if you're looking for fragrance and you are more of one of those high-end type of fragrance uh, people, I would suggest like Dillard's or going into like Nordstrom Sex or whatever and more of an upscale mall because I didn't know this until one of the Nordstrom's uh, um, workers told me this, sales associates told me this, like certain Nordstrom's carry certain things like high-end things like your Gucci Prada, Louis and all your high-end fragrance and those are typically the Nordstrom's that are attached to high-end malls. So I did not, I went to a really nice mall, but it was not a high-end mall. So I guess my loss, my bad. It's not a big deal. I don't, I don't even want a perfume. I got body splash to last me from here to, a, you know, my next lifetime. But here is the first pair of shoes I got. Isn't this box so cute? I love this color. Um, These shoes are by, I don't know. Don't even know how to pronounce that. But I got these. I thought these were so cute. Okay, are they cute or not? Like, I am, like, obsessed with these shoes. Um, and I'm a little disappointed in the sizing because I have never, ever, ever in my lifetime wore a size 9. I am typically a 7.5 or 8. I had to get a 9 in these. 
like literally get a 90 of these but these are so cute and i think these were on sale for 60 at dillard's i have been wanting the dior slides so bad but i just couldn't justify paying that much for some slides or some sandals. Um, so, your good old Steve Madden. Your good old Steve Madden. And when I say Dillard's was a whole hot ass mess, it was a whole mess. It was just shoes everywhere. No women in there was going crazy. But anyways, I found these. Good old Steve Madden. When you can't find what you're looking for or you're on a budget or just can't afford it, or whatever the case may be. Maybe you're just like me that you can dig in the bank and get what you need to out of the bank to get what you want. But you just can't justify spending that amount of money. Steve Madden. Steve Madden. These were originally $60. These were marked down to $34.99. These are so cute. So the Dior's look just like this, but of course it says Dior. It wouldn't say Paris, but that's good enough. Good enough. And you know what's so crazy? These were just laying on a, like one of those, um, y'all, misters right there. I had to cut and do this so many times because he was all up in the Kool-Aid up in here in the closet. <laughs> it's getting on my nerves. <laughs> he, he just won't let me be. He won't let me live. But these were just sitting on a, um, like one of their displays with, in no box. And it didn't go with the rest of the shoes because they were not Steve Mattins. And just so I looked up, just so I happened to look up, these are a size, um, eight. Yeah. They had one more size, which was like a nine and a half, ten, I believe. No box. <laughs> no box. So the next one, babe. Could you bring me my water, please, doll? Darling, um, my water I got from Nordstrom's. Okay. I'm so thirsty. Then I got these. Once again, they were at a place in nobody's box. Um, these are also Steve Madden's. I got these in an eight. These are originally a hundred dollars. These were marked down to 35. Thank you. They are so nice in Nordstrom. She went and got me a whole water because I said I was thirsty. Thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. I had to take a break. But yeah, I got these. These are also some shoes I wanted so bad, but I could not justify spending $100 for some Steve Madden shoes. No. So, yeah. Um, I don't know about you dolls. I don't know where you all stay. And I hope you guys are all doing well. But I stay in Texas. You guys all know that if you go back almost two years ago, you see that we re relocated from Atlanta to Dallas. And in Texas, you could get away with wearing sandals until about November. Like, I'm just being real. You could get away with wearing sandals until november and then you'll start back wearing them again in probably like what march april <laughs> so yeah you you can go ahead and, and and go on those clearance shops or whatever i mean those you know the bargain shopping and still buy sandals because you can still wear them here for a long time versus in atlanta you would probably want to start wearing sandals probably about september here you can go three more months so that was pretty cool. So those is what what I got for my birthday. I guess you could say for my birthday. Um, I what I was supposed to get for my birthday is perfume, but y'all know I would have got those regardless if it was my birthday or not, because I just had that type of mister. <laughs> Let's just say, I'm blessed, I'm blessed. How did that song go by by Freddie Hammond? Bless, bless, yeah, dun, 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 dun. We're blessed in the city, 
We're blessed in the field. We're blessed when we come and when we go. We cast down every strong sick stronghold, sickness, and privity must cease. I think that's the words, because the devil is defeated. We are blessed. Can't play that song because I have actually been tagged twice um for having music in my videos copyright um so yeah youtube will tag you um and yeah harass you until you remove it so yeah so let me i can't even play a song so mm, when in rome no i should say when in spain um i got <laughs> i went to nordstrom's um and just picked up some Charlotte Tilbury. Y'all know that I have scaled back from wearing a lot of makeup. As you can see, let me get close. I really don't have any makeup on. Excuse this. This is like a bump that never had a head, so couldn't do too much with it. That's slowly going away. And I was trying on the new Fenty um, foundation, and I don't know. I just walked out the store with that looking a whole mess at a Sephora, but anywho, I just got like this, this uh, makeup artist by Mac, actually that was in Nordstrom's, suggested this, she suggests this um, setting spray, so I, I was like, okay, but the setting spray she was spraying was like $60, I wasn't going to pay that for no setting spray, so this one was only like $20, $20, $23. I don't wear makeup every day, so there's no need for me to pay that much for no setting spray. So, this is another, this is their Airbrush Flawless Finish Complex Perfecting Powder. If you're a makeup guru, you already know what this is. And I got this shade deep. And I actually have it on. It looks really, really good. So, that's something else. Um, let me see. I'm not sure how much that was. So, the um, powder is $40. And I really, really needed some powder. I know I have so much makeup. Um, I'm going to start going through makeup and just donating it. But um, I don't have any setting powder, like actual setting powder that's not under eye powder that's got that yellow tint to it. So, yeah, I just, I don't have any setting powder. I'm, I'm like completely out. So, yeah, that's what I got. Um... Some of the stuff I got for my birthday, like I said, I'm supposed to, I got some new glasses. Um, I got like five new pair of glasses. I'm just waiting on them to come. I am a prescription wearer, uh, uh, glasses wearer, so I have to um, upload my prescription, and that takes longer than just ordering a pair of glasses. Um, yeah, that's all I want to come and share with you guys. I'm going to have to get off of here. Um, Georgia, I think, is going to play his game, and he is so loud, and he yells at the screen. So I don't want that in my video. I don't want it at all in my background. So, um, y'all look at my... I'm in my closet, and until I've, like, started recording this video, I forgot about half of the stuff that was in this closet. Look, this is something I got from Shein. Never wore it. Um, I am getting ready to get some, um, shelves to go in here so that I can put my handbags on it because I don't like my expensive handbags just sitting like this. This is not one. This is from Shein. But like my Tory Burch, my Gucci and all that, they're just thrown up here and I don't like that. So, um, yeah, we're going to put some shelves right here on this side. Um. I, I found some that I really like from um, Amazon. So, yeah, that'll be cool. But, um, yeah. Hola, dolls. How's everybody doing? Today is Saturday. I got six days until my birthday. Um, I am on my way to get my birthday present. Your gel does not like picking out my birthday gifts. He said I'm too picky. 
he much rather for me to just pick it out and he'll front the bill. Ain't he such a romance? <laughs> He's so romantic, but I guess I am picky, so that I guess that's the way to deal with picky people. Here come your Jill. Ay, ay, ay. But anyways, he was standing right there. I, I don't know. He don't really like to be on the camera. And when he's on the camera, all he says is, Hello, YouTube. He's something else. He's not a, a big social media person. Um, But, yeah, um, that's where we're going. And then we're going to go to Cheesecake Factory. Because that's where he wants to go to eat. He loves the Cheesecake Factory. But anyways, um... Yeah, I'm in your Joe's new car. I am just so proud of Mr. Mr. I'm just so proud of him. Like everything that he said that he wanted, he was going to do, he was going to accomplish. He has done that like and over succeeded that. So I am just so proud of his. You guys know that his birthday is like a month after mine's. So... He wants to go out of town, so we'll probably be heading to either Austin or Houston for his birthday. Y'all know he's not like a whole birthday bash type of person like I am. He likes to go to like museums and stuff, so that's probably where we'll end up going for his birthday. But yeah, like, can I just say I'm proud? Um, Yeah, nice. Let me get y'all a little glimpse. He wanted something sporty. I'm not going to show y'all everything because I know he's more of a private person. But, um, babe, I'm telling him about your new car. Uh -huh. But, um, yeah, he wanted something sporty, so he got something sporty this year. Traded in the 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 other SUV and got something else. Anyways, y'all, look at my gray coming in. Babe, say, um, hola, welcome to my channel. Hola, bienvenidos a mi... A mi channel? <laughs> yeah. Alrighty then. <laughs> I am having the worst luck. I came in here to perfume shop for my birthday. I don't like not one smell. So now we're over here at Chews. Y'all, we in Cheesecake Factory. Y'all, look how long my hair has gotten. It's about, like, right here. Um, we had, like, a not-too-good experience when we first got here. I am truly, truly my family's keeper because Johnny... just paying for the food you're paying for the service and they need to go hand in hand or I'm honey I'm gonna say something y'all know we always at Cheesecake Factory this is like your Joe's favorite restaurant look what is that oh oh and I'm getting I'm getting my hair done I finally found someone to do my hair and I went to school with her so I'm very familiar with her so I'll check back in with you guys <laughs> 